Okay, when you're playing a lot and, and working as well, so you have a busy lifestyle, I think for me, it's important to start off the day well and, and get a good breakfast. So I tend to have porridge every morning, something that will fill me up and keep me going. And um, a bit of planning as well then. So all my meals are kind of planned that I know when I'm doing breakfast, lunch, dinner, and my evening tea and my snacks in between. So I tend to have my apples and bananas in the car in the office so I can pull from those. Yeah, so on a typical match day, um, I would try to, I suppose, get up early. Um, I'd usually have maybe two breakfasts, funnily enough. I'd get up straight away and have a, a small bowl of porridge and put some maybe frozen berries into it, some chia seeds, just something small. I like to go for a walk then maybe stretch because then I come back to have something smaller again, maybe just some scrambled egg and some wholemeal toast. Um, usually if our matches are on at two o'clock in the afternoon, um, I might then have maybe a larger snack at about 11 or 12 and that's probably my main meal for the match like that's what I would carve up on I suppose for the match that's my energy so I'd have probably a stir fry is the one I usually go to a chicken stir fry with a small bit of vegetables um, either brown rice or brown noodles and then coming up to the match then it'd probably be really important just to get uh, small bits in maybe every 45 minutes or every hour so that could include maybe half a banana some almonds um, lots of water though, I try to get a lot of water in and it's probably match, yeah it'd be probably match time by then I suppose so um, I suppose the main thing there would be trying to eat my main meal about three hours before uh, the match to make sure it's digested because you want to use your energy for the match and not I suppose digesting the food and that's something I've had to learn over the years <laughs> because I've often eaten too close to a match and then you feel really full, maybe a bit sluggish but um, I suppose Another thing would be to try that in matches or training, not before championship matches, maybe try league matches like, and find out what works for you because it can be different for everyone. Some people like eating closer or further away from the match, but that's mainly what my diet before a match would look like. Mm. Yeah, so I suppose it's, it's important that you get a good balance between um, saying sort of st sticking to your diet plan and then going off it a bit. For me, I'd probably nearly every, especially champs game, at, Every, after every champs game, I definitely go for a treat. Um, even it's just just really refreshing the head, sort of mentally again. Uh, you know you've done or put in a lot of work through the week, and it's just sort of treating yourself. And I suppose if you're sticking to the diet plan the whole time, um, so your head can go all over the place too. And um, I just feel that maybe treating yourself as well just lightens the mood up as well, and makes it easier. And sort of you don't, then once you do have your treat meal, you don't mind then go back to the diet plan. It's sort of um, helps you to right now but if you're sticking to the diet plan the whole time I'd find it very hard um, so you just need that wee break every now and again.